Hi everyone, welcome back to Little Medical School. Today, we are diving into fascinating facts about our eyes and the condition called color blindness with our special guest, Dr. Ratna. Hi Dr. Ratna. Hi Jeremy. Hi everyone, it's so exciting to be here today. Doctor, before we start, can we please know what does an ophthalmologist do? Sure. I'm Dr. Ratna Ramaraj, Consultant Ophthalmologist at Columbia Asia Hospital, Bukit Jalil. As someone who cares for your eye condition, I examine and treat eye problems so that you can see clearly. That includes for those who cannot see colours. Wait, so people cannot see colours? Yes, Jeremy. There are people who cannot see colours. That is what we call as colour blindness. They cannot see the difference or cannot tell the colours apart from each other. So what colours can they see? There are certain colours that they can see and certain they cannot. And there are certain colours that they cannot differentiate. For an example, red and green may appear the same. Or blue and yellow may be similar to them. In very rare cases, they're not able to see any colours at all and they will be seeing objects as black and white. But why people cannot see colours? There are many causes to it. Most of them are born with colour blindness. That is what we call as genetic pass down from the parents. There are many other causes for colour blindness. For an example, it could be a retinal injury, brain injury, stroke, glaucoma, or taking certain medications. So, can we see the rainbow? Like many of us who can see all the colours of the rainbow, we are not able to see all colours. They may be able to see two or three colours, which includes blue and yellow. Then, Doctor, do they know that they are colourblind? Oh, very good question, Jeremy. Most people with colour blindness do not know that they have this condition. That is because the symptoms are usually very mild that they don't know that it affects their daily activities. So, how do they know if they are colourblind or not? As an ophthalmologist, I can use certain tests to test for their colour blindness. For an example, we use a simple circle with multiple coloured dots to test colour blindness. Maybe you could tell me the numbers in the colour dots? Oh, I see it. So they cannot see the numbers there, right doctor? It will be hard for them. To manage this condition, we have a few options. That includes special lens or glasses that increase the contrast of the colour, so it will help them to differentiate the colours. Thank you, Doctor. Now I understand what is colour blindness. You're welcome, Jeremy. We may take our eyes as granted and do not realise how important it is to us. Our eyes may be small, but it has done an amazing job to look at the world. So if you have any eye problem, you can visit me at Columbia Asia Hospital, Bukit Jalil or any other ophthalmologist at any Columbia Asia Hospital. Thanks for joining. See you next time. Bye. Bye.